Hey guys, Tim Tim Purple here, aka Miss Piggy Scarecrow. And I wanted to come up here to uh, Bug Sag To let people know, um, that was my mom talking, but um, to let people know that, um, Everybody should do what they want to do on their own YouTube channel. As long as it's appropriate or anything like that. I mean, you know, do your own thing. That's what makes any and everybody unique. When you do your own channel, do your own videos, you're accomplishing something that is you. As, a, as putting you as a part of you inside these videos. Because it's all about each person. When they make their own YouTube channel and then they start making the videos, no matter what it is, it could be a game, it could be a challenge, it could be live stream, it could be this, it could be that. You know, no matter what, you're putting yourself it may be a lot or whatever, but you put yourself in there, no matter how much was in there. But, you know, even if it was just a tiny bit, your personality is in your videos, you know, and you make your own little, you make the video your own. And that's what's so great about YouTube. You can make your own videos however you want it, whatever you want to do. And you created something that come from you. It didn't come from nobody else. Because, you know, I see different videos from different people. And, you know, they might have a group of people with them or they might be by themselves. It doesn't matter. Or there's live streaming or you know like that. You know, they're doing what they love. They're doing what they want to do. And it's not hurting nobody personally. It's not, you know, hurting any certain things. But do what makes you happy. But don't hurt nobody. And don't hurt. You know, certain people don't hurt certain things at all. Just, we need to get back to where YouTube was happier. You know what I'm saying? It was more simpler and more happier and more just carefree. Good entertainment. Because it's gotten to the place where some... Things are getting too carried away to the point where it's not even funny anymore. And, um, and it don't even have to be the hackers or the, the haters or anything like that. It could be just the people that's making videos. They are just, some, some people are just, Taking it way too far about things. And it's not even fun to watch that any videos. You just have to really start making videos that's going to benefit somebody. Or it's going to benefit yourself too. To make it a whole lot better. To make it a whole lot easier. Because when you're feeding hate with hate, you're just getting more hate. And do not, do not hate something that somebody else hated and put hate out there too because that makes it that much worse and it puts more hate. You know, just don't worry about nothing. 
You put your content out there. And don't worry about what somebody else says. Because as long as you put content out there that makes you happy, that you feel like you fulfilled something that you wanted to do, you may be surprised of how many people will come up and say, well, I like that. I like what you did there. It makes it a whole, it makes the community a whole lot easier because the YouTube is a community. And, you know, there's a lot of people that just don't want the drama. They don't want the hate. They don't want this and that. They just want to see videos that might brighten up their day. Or they can actually say, hey, I agree with that or something like that. Just stop the hate. Just stop the... Just, you know, do good content. That's what gets you better subscribers. That's going to be more dedicated to you than you hating and ranting about stuff that's not worth hating or ranting about. Just make videos that makes you happy and eventually... You're going to find other people that's going to make be just as happy with your content as you are. And that's all I got to say about that. Because, you know, there's too many times when people do certain things and you bring in the wrong kind of people into your subscriber box. And then when they see that you're not doing that no more. Your subscriber count's going to go down with all these haters because you were doing these hate videos. They want to see the hate videos. They want to see the drama videos. you got to bring in the right kind of subscribers for your channel. You can't keep putting hate videos on your channel because when you do, you bring in the wrong kind of people. Into your subscribers. And there is a lot of people out there. That's got great. Video content out there. And I appreciate everyone. That is putting great content out there. And I appreciate it too. Somebody's going crazy on these um, notifications. But yeah, the ones that's been putting a lot of great videos up, a lot of great content, I appreciate everyone that does that because it makes it a whole lot better and it's easier on the eyes and ears when you're watching the video and you listen to what they have to say. And it makes it a whole lot easier for you to get the subscribers that are more laid back. Because, I mean, some people just don't like the drama, just don't like the bull crap. And I'm pat like that, too. I just don't like the bull crap all the time. I don't like the drama all the time. I just want to have, get on YouTube and listening to people actually talking like decent human beings. And you don't matter what age they are what age they are or anything like that. As long as they got good decent videos and they're not trashing somebody or any of that and they're just telling like stories or something like that. <clears throat> it's easier on the ears. And it's easier on the eyes, and it's easier on the feelings. You know what I mean? So, remember that when you're doing your next video. Will I get better subscribers that are going to be really behind me, or am I going to get haters behind me? But I can tell you, if what you put up there... Is what you're going to get back. If you throw hate 
and all kind of stuff over there, you're going to get hate back. If you do co good content and all that, you're going to get good comments back. It's all how you want to put yourself out there. You know, it's like the old saying goes, to get respect, you give respect. If you give the best con content and the best videos and you're giving the respect of other people, you're going to get back respect in the comment section. It's just truthful and honest. You have to really be truthful to yourself and be honest with yourself before you throw any kind of videos out there that could cause hate. Is that who you really are? Are you a hater yourself? When you start putting hate videos to contract with the hate videos you saw. If you're not really one of these people that really hate somebody, don't put hate videos out there to get somebody back. Because you, cause your reputation, when you get up on YouTube, you start making videos, your reputation's on the line. Either you're going to be a good person, making decent, honest videos, or you're going to be one of these people that's a haters and all that. Your reputation will be ruined. It's all how you put yourself out there. You're your own worst enemy. Either be honest with yourself, or just keep being dishonest to yourself and putting bad videos. But that's all for now. I thank you. Talk to you later. Bye.